So, the infamous Yankee letter has been revealed. Is it damaging to the Yankees? Or is it a big nothing burger? Yo, New York Yankees fans, yet again, it is Felix from NYNews.com, like always, hola como estas? So the infamous Yankee letter has been revealed. SNY exclusive. SNY obtained the letter which has not been unsealed. I don't know about the legality of that, but it states this article. On Tuesday morning, SNY exclusively obtained the letter which has not yet been unsealed. The letter does not implicate the Yankees in a sign-stealing scheme similar to the one for which the Houston Astros were punished when batters received the signs in real time without the help of a runner on second base. It does show, as SNY previously reported it would, that the Yankees used the video replay room in 2015 and 2016 to decode sign sequences and pass them to a runner on second base who would then relay them to the batter. For that, the Yankees received a fine of $100,000, a previously unreported amount. The letter clears the Yankees of using Yes Network cameras to steal signs, which the Red Sox alleged. The letter does not accuse the Yankees of sign stealing after the crucial date of September 15, 2017, when Manfred announced that from that day forward, electronic sign stealing would be subject to more severe punishments. In fact, the letter does not accuse the team of stealing signs at any point during the 2017 season. So there you have it, a big nothing burger. I think it was 4D chess played by the Yankees, making it seem like, oh my god, when this letter comes out, it's the end of the world. Just to silence, once again, critics of the New York Yankees once that letter was revealed. So again, if you have any opinions, leave it in the comment section below. This has been Felix from NYNews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you on next time. Before it hits the front page, NY